Find the internal loads at 6 meters away from the wall. Step 1 in finding internal loads is typically to draw the free body diagram of the entire beam. But look at what I want to do. I want to find what's happening at the spot about right here where I've got 2 meters to the end of the beam and 6 meters over here. So I want to break my beam up into these two pieces. I can take either side of this beam to figure out what my loads are. There's no point in writing equilibrium for the whole wall to be able to use the left hand side when in this case I can use the right hand side. So I'm going to draw a free body diagram of the right hand piece of my beam. I'm going to include the 6 newton point load. I'm also going to include the portion of the distributed load that acts on the part of the beam I'm drawing. So I have a 4 newton per meter load that acts over these 2 meters. Now it also acts for 3 meters past here, but I don't care. All I care about is what acts on my piece of the beam. I'm at this point going to put on my equivalent, my um, internal loads following the sign conventions. So I have V, M, and N. These are the sign conventions for the right hand piece of the beam. Now I can write my equations of equilibrium to figure out what they are. So the sum of the forces in X says N equals 6 newtons. The sum of the forces in Y now I can replace my equivalent point load and say my distributed load by its equivalent point load and say V plus 8 newtons, 4 times 2 equals 0. So V is going to be minus 8 newtons. And I can take the sum of the moments at the break. My equivalent point load is 8 newtons and it acts 1 meter away from the break in a counterclockwise way. My moment acts at the break clockwise and N and M pass through the break as does my 6 newton load. So that's all I end up with. So my internal loads that I calculated are N equals 6 newtons, V equals minus 8 newtons, and M equals 8 newton meters. If you were to find out what the loads were at the wall and then come back and do the equivalent, the internal loads at the same spot from the left, you would get the same numbers, but you don't have to.